Hey guys, so today I'm going to be sharing with you a very special holiday gift that's going on right now at Estee Lauder. I meant to mention this in my last video, but I am currently a makeup artist for Estee Lauder, so that's why I use a lot of Estee Lauder products and that's why I'm showing them on my channel, but they are truly incredible products, so I am very happy to share them and tell everyone about them. So let's jump right into it. So first of all, everything comes in this beautiful red train case. It's a nice big size, there's zipper compartments, you can fit a ton of stuff in here. I've actually been putting all my skincare products in here and like toting it around with me around the house and doing facials whenever I can. So I mean you can use it for whatever you want, it's a great case. You also get this little travel cosmetics bag that's perfect for throwing in your purse and I'm going to throw some products in here just to show you. Um, let's see, I'm going to throw a lipstick in here, my mascara, my little perfume, you know, a lip gloss for just in case, and my advanced night repair. And that's everything I need for the day. You get an eyeshadow palette which has six shadows and two different blushes. You get a limited edition all over shimmer, three different pure color lipsticks. This one's a bright pink color, this one's a shimmery bronze color, and this one's sort of a baby pink color. You also get two lip glosses and these are in a shimmery bronze color and a shimmery pink color as well to sort of match the lipsticks. You get a full size sumptuous extreme mascara which is now my favorite mascara. Before the Sumptuous Infinite mascara was my favorite, but now this has taken its spot. It's amazing. You get an adorable little sample of the Modern Muse perfume. This is a great perfume. I think it's gonna become a staple in my collection. You get a full size eye makeup remover. You get a little mini sample of the Advanced Night Repair. And what's great about this bottle is it has a little dropper on it. Um, a lot of the little ones they don't have a dropper so this is kind of a nice little bonus and then you also get a 0.5 ounce resilience lift lotion this is a firming sculpting face and neck cream um, even if you're young and you're not really worried about aging or anything this is a great lotion um, it's never too early to start the anti-aging process and uh, it smells great there's also a really luminous finish to this as well so it's beautiful under makeup so I filmed two tutorials with this makeup set that comes in this beautiful case. I did a daytime bronzy look and then also what you're seeing right now that's on my face is more of a nighttime smoky look. So uh, let's jump right into the tutorial. Also I just want to give a quick shout out to Cami at the Catwalk Salon in Bonnie Lake. She just did my hair and I am so happy with the cut and color. I decided to go a little bit more blonde this time, a little more neutral blonde. I naturally have very dark hair, you can probably see. It's a balayage and uh, I love it. So thank you, Cami. So if you live in the greater Seattle area and you're looking for a new hairstylist, go check Cami out at the Catwalk Salon in Bonnie Lake and I'll leave the details in the description down below. So I'm going to dip into this light beigey cream shade and I'm just going to apply that all over my lid with a fluffy brush. And I just want to do this so I can give my eyelid a nice base so all my other eyeshadows will go on nice and smooth as well. Then I'm going into the slightly darker beigey color and I'm just working that into the crease and a little bit down on the lid as well. Just very messy, just giving a little bit more definition. Next I'm going to be using this shimmery bronze color and putting that on a more dense eyeshadow brush and just putting that on the lower part of the lid and I'm just packing that on there until I'm happy with the color. Now I'm going to use this more mauve purple shimmer color and just using that in the crease uh, with my big blending brush. And then I'm using that same brownie shimmery color on the bottom lash line with my dense shadow brush and just buffing that in back and forth just to create some definition in a light shadow. And then again with that silvery purpley mauve color and just running over that really quickly. Um, nothing too crazy or special. Now I'm just using my Sumptuous Extreme Mascara and coating the top and bottom lashes with two coats of mascara. And then I'm using the shade 08 blush. This is 
peach passion, I believe, and dusting that on the cheeks, not really focusing so much on the apples, more on the sides of the face. And yeah, brushing back towards the hairline, just like I always do. Then I'm using this all over shimmer, which is limited edition and comes in the kit, obviously. And it's really beautiful. It's kind of a bronzy pinky tone and brushing that over the cheeks as well. I like using this as more of like a blush topper and this gives you a little bit of extra sheen and glow. Now I'm just finishing off the look with a light pink lip gloss that comes in the kit. This has a shimmer in it so it looks nice and fresh and keeps your lips looking full throughout the day. And it stays on really well. I was really impressed with how long it lasted. And this is the finished daytime look. It's very natural but yet you're still wearing makeup. It's very fresh and light, bronzy and it's very wearable. Just like every look I've done so far. <laughs> So now onto the nighttime look. The first thing I'm going to do is line my inner waterline as well as tightline my top waterline with a black waterproof eyeliner. This one is from Stila, so this doesn't come in the kit. I just had to go into my collection and grab something. And uh, yeah, sorry for the funny faces there. That was a little scary. Now I'm just using this dark brown shadow and just defining the lower lash line a little bit more as well as putting that on the very lower part of the upper lid just to give a little bit more of a smokier look. Um, the daytime look is very bronzy. This one's a little bit more smoked out. Now I'm using that purpley mauve shimmer shade again and going back into the crease, giving a little bit more pop and shimmer. And then I'm doing a very, very thin line of black eyeliner on the top lash line. Nothing crazy, but then I do go into the inner corner and um, I'm just bringing that down a little bit to create more of like a cat eye look. So bringing it into the inner corner like this just helps give a little bit more definition, makes the eyes look a little bit more, you know, like what Tyra Banks says, smize. <laughs> it just makes them look a little bit more smizy, if that makes any sense. Now I'm using this white pearly shadow up in the corner. It does have a little bit of glitter in it, but I love glitter. In fact, my nickname is Glitterbug. Uh, shout out to my Aunt Karen who's called me that since I was born. And this is the finished eye look for nighttime. And I also popped on some false lashes, but I honestly don't think it made that much of a difference, so you can skip that. Then I'm just going back into this all over shimmer and I'm just going to reapply that on my cheeks. I want some extra glow and a little bit more color. I'm putting that on the cheeks and then a little bit all over the face and down the neck on the forehead, kind of using it as a bronzer. I mean, who doesn't love a little glow? And it's the holidays, so you can get away with it. Now I'm just going to use that bronzy lipstick, which is very shimmery and I kind of like it. I almost never use shimmery lipsticks, but I was really happy with how it looked and how it turned out. It was beautiful and it wore for a really long time just like the lip gloss before. And it looks great just like that, but I decided to top it off with some of the lip gloss just on the center of the lips to give a little bit more plumpness and fullness to the look. So this is the finished look for nighttime. It's really easy to take it from day to night. It's something that everyone can do. I think it's also a very flattering look and will look great on so many different eye shapes and skin tones. So I hope you found this video helpful and go check out the kit from Estee Lauder before it runs out. Thanks so much for watching. So in my last video I brought Bam Bam on here and I made him wear a Santa hat. So I thought it was only fair that I put mine on today and he looks normal. So I don't know. I think he wore it better than I did. <laughs> and he has this perfect little ponytail to hold it. So yeah. I'm a huge pet lover so let me know if you have pets down below.